What's up, my guys? So, as you know, the update 1.14. I thought it would... they didn't even go to 1.12.9, they just skipped to 1.14. Like, I totally skipped to 1.13 because the last update was just 1.12.3. So, maybe I got it wrong. I don't know, but let's get into it. Season 1, yeah, one of the <laughs> most things I like about this game is Keffer always finds a way to bring in more pay-to-win features into the game. That doesn't really make sense on why I should like it, but <laughs> it's, one, it's one of their best features. I hope they don't watch this video. So, let's go. In the post-apocalyptic times, dangers come from anywhere, even from the sea. What, last year seeing that, the, um... If any of you played Last of Nerf when it first came out, the, what, that one event, the ship event? I know it has a specific name, but I can't remember it because I never played back then. But it is now back, and it is way more harder. You'll see in this video where I will be defeating every boss in the video, no matter how hard they are. Since the virus found notes made by Darren Wells, seasoned sailor who went off to the sea at the wrong time. But now word spread about a mysterious ship which crashed in the south. Sailors have spread across the familiar locations. You see it saying sailors. When you fight the boss, the sailors come. You only need two unmodified glots, but you know, I like to keep my weapons modified. So, with the beginning of the season, you receive access to a weekly quest as... As you complete them, you will get various resources and the most sturdy survivors who will complete all the quests will get unique rewards. New skins for Chopper, Corvo, Corgis, and other valuable items. The list of quests will be updating in a special section de 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 dedicated to the first season. Well, this is, they actually wrote a lot here this time. Maybe they're not going to miss anything that's supposed to be said in this update like they did in the last one. As you know, in the last one, they never said, oh yeah, some NPCs' durability on their guns and armor will be lowered. They And they didn't also say, don't try to kill the raiders when they come to your base because you won't get anything useful. They didn't say that. They also didn't say, if you kill the NPC on the VSS NPC person in the red zone or in the oak areas, you will not get a good VSS. You will get one shot. They never said any of that stuff, and they never said that it was going to mess with the bike event, but... Kefir, I don't understand you. So, the bike upgrade system has been reconsidered. Every survivor can have only one bike, but customize it the way they want. Even upgrade it according to their personal needs. To do that, visit Jane at the gas station. As you know, the gas station is no longer clearable. There's no longer any zombies there. Because the Wanderers killed all them. And for some reason, the zombies don't want to come back. Even though they always came back when I killed them, but okay. Don't forget to bring a few parts, and she will add new perks to your iron friend. If you already upgraded the bike yourself, some parts part of the experience gain will remain. If you have collected a lot of modification blueprints, they've been converted into magazines. That can be exchanged with Jane for bike experience. All stuff from the carrier will be waiting for you in your box. By the way, speaking about the gas station, now it is possible to get there only if you have a bike. The story of Darren Wells. What happened on board remains a big mystery. Some mention about a mutiny. Others about the attack of the awaiters section to clear up the mystery. Finding remains of Darren Wells' journal, who was one of the sailors staying aboard till the end. Last but not least, cute corgi puppies have been added to the game, along with them three new perks. Earner, Fool, and Lucky. The first one can the first one considerably decreases the need for food of all dogs by 10%. With the second one, your corgi doesn't need food when staying in the dog crate. And with the third perk, you will receive one coin a day. Yo! They got something good! Let's go! 
Okay, I see what Ke I see you, Kefir. You actually doing something good, even though you brought like three more pay to win features in the game. But hey, at least you get one gold if you get the right skill for your corgi puppy. So you should be happy about that. I am. I don't know about you. But. Who wants to see the first pay to win feature, which is going to be shown on here? The best pay to win feature, by the way. Because before this update came, if you clicked on season one, you could It showed Milcore, DSS, two tactical backpacks, C4s, and something else. AK 47 grenade. Let's see. Get premium. Oh, it's. Oh. Get premium in 10 levels at a huge discount. Give access to her season, rewards, and tasks. I think I'm gonna wait a day before I get into premium in case anything changes. I mean, I won't be able to. Ooh, they give me 10 hatchets. I don't know why, do does the banjos look different in the game now? Do, do they look different? <gasps> Whoa, your guy changed. What the? Do you see this? They changed. What the? This feels like when the game first came out. <laughs> I feel baffled. Oh my god. But as you know, since the bosses will be incredibly strong, this is what we're going to do. You don't have to, but I'm putting on full durability swaps because I don't know. Because I haven't really looked into it that much. Where's my swatch shoes at? Okay, so apparently, durability isn't that great on that. Carbon con? No. Factory card. Of course. Of course you give me a factory card. But, while well, I do some stuff here, let's go to the boss battle. So, let me show you the first feature. So, you can no longer run to the gas station. You have to drive there. So, for those few people that was just wasting their guns to clear the gas station, you can no longer do that. And the bunker is now a red zone. There is this, but for some reason, access is denied and I have no reason. I don't know why. Opens during the last week of the season. Okay. So, as you can see. Oh, you still can't. I swear it said you can no longer run here. But, okay. So let's show the first part of the annoying update. I know I haven't been making videos, but I've been working on some. Kinda, kinda not. Because I was waiting for the update to come out. Finally came out. And you can actually ride through the gas station. Oh. I'm sorry. Don't. To be honest, I could probably take out all of these guys. Some of them you can't actually click on like this. I'm gonna note you a few reasons why I don't, I don't think this will be worth uneven using. Okay, for it, let me hint to the glue part. All that 200 glue, you can make so much reinforced armor and be so rich in the game. Um, the blue in the wire, not a biggie though. Um, the regular wiring, not a biggie. Springs. 
kind of a big E screws. Big E, because you can make so much metal pipes with those. Um, air filter is not a big E because the red box gives you a bunch of them. Plastic parts, not a biggie at all. You get so much at the police department. Metal composite. That's a big biggie because um, that's really hard to get. Engine parts. I don't think that's. I don't think you should be able to do that because unless you already had engine parts saved up, you probably won't have enough a time to get all those engine parts within that day, within 22 days. That's just my point. 30 steel plates. The biggest biggie that you should not put in. 30 of those. Two of those you can... Out of 30 of those you can make two metal floors out of... If it sold 40 you can make two metal walls. Which is why I don't think it's worth it. But if you want some... If you want this... Choose it. Oh, I'm not going to knock you down for choosing it. Chain... Um, power, durability, volume, damage down, increase, disturb. Fuel consumption, decrease, durability, tank volume. I think I'm going to do dur power, tank volume, durability. Yeah, tank volume is probably... Loadable, yes. Yeah, I'm choosing durability. <laughs> Volume and durability are probably going to be your best bets. If you consumption increased by 5%, it's not going to be worth it. Because if you do you right, you won't be using any. And so... Yeah, it's going to probably take a lot. I'm not going to lie. I don't know why they didn't let us keep it all, which is kind of annoying. No pickings. Oh, that's the truck. Can be attained for tax in season one. Can be found in a box of coordinates with... Gordon is with the military floppy. Can be attained by up for upgrading your bike. Ma'am? I'ma need all my stuff back. I don't like this update. Can what are you doing in here? That's just three slots. I'm not I'm not so happy about the three slots. But if you want to collect trees, you know, go ahead. But let's get on to the first boss battle. Why do I have a problem with this update? Because I look, for the loyal viewers, the people who have watched since day one <laughs> since day one of when I first unlocked my motorcycle. I have turned in so much stuff. And I don't think it's... I'm getting my worth back. But... I'm probably going to have to use these guns to take out the zombies. Okay. We're just going to go through a spree, speed run. So, see you in a sec. Alright, so after we do the bike event... I am going to head over to the police department to kill the first boss. Hopefully not get annihilated. In my perspective, I probably should have grabbed the military book bag in case I do die. I know you can always get your stuff back, but the thing is, this boss is really fast at it's, it's probably going to be impossible to get your stuff back. It might be possible. But how the police department is, like, modeled, it's hard to not get hit by a zombie with no shoes on.
Okay, it's this one. What's up, my guys? I'm just gonna let y'all fight it out. Hey, I'm sorry, but someone had to do it to you. Now, did y'all even have any good guns? You had bandages, but I'm looking for the moolah. I see. I do not need any of those backpacks. <laughs> Look at all these, and I I have two military ones at my base, along with. The one in the inbox. Did they fix it? Oh, they might have fixed it. <gasps> Thank you. Bike events are now worth it to do yet again. They fixed my man's update. Hey, where's his gun? Wasn't there supposed to be like an AK-47? I don't know what happened to his. Maybe they robbed him. Maybe that's why they were having the shootout. You just get those feelings that a nigga was robbed. Maybe it's just me. I think it's just me. I don't know. It might just be me. Yep, you're seeing the blue four blue badges here. You don't see any green ones? Why? I don't have any more. It's a sad day that I have to do the police department again. Don't know when I'm going to do it. I'm just hoping it's going to be soon. Ooh. I'm gonna have to do it. I'm sorry, um, new players. I'm not doing that to be a dick in any kind of way. No kind of way. Those who do the bunker and are having problems opening the red box and y'all really need those gas masks, I'm not doing it to be a dick. Just to let you know. So, I only have three slots. So, yeah. It's, it's dressed, drastic, but I did get a Glock from there, I got a shotgun, did I get a different Glock, no, I don't think so, but let me grab Yon, let me put that in there, I might have grabbed too much first aid kits, I'm not gonna lie to you, but let's get into it, who cares. But, look, open your blue badges, though, if, like, you're a new player. Do not try to open the purple badges. Just for the simple fact is that they're really hard to get. And, like, you want to make your mods before you even attempt to make the purple ones. But I only need two carbon composites. So that's why I'm opening it. Oh, I already have that. Oh, so give me that. Hmm? Hmm? I'm just joking. I'm happy. Yeah. Give me the same one twice. Does that stand for Jorge being happy? Maybe. Can I get one? I don't already. I got a Uzi. Got one. Can I get another? Yes. Two Glocks. Yo, you cannot go bad with two Glocks. Where's the one? Oh, three. And I need three. Okay. Now your boy can feel happy. <laughs> Along with this. Because I'm not trying to waste my SWAT armor here. 
Let's the killing start. Hey, bud. I don't know why he's cornered like that. But sneak skill is always best for this kind. Hey, buddy. I probably won't be able to take home a lot. But I tell you what, I will be able to take home enough factory parts to make one mod. Yeah. Don't look at me with that sad expression, because I know one of you is probably looking at me with the sad expression. Like, what? One mod? Yeah, too, sadly, mods are really expensive in this game. So even if I stink, they don't want to get up. Okay. Buddy, it's time for you to die. Ooh -hoo. See how far his head went up? That boy. I just know we came here for the boss battle, so see you then. I was gonna say I have I have some good news and bad news. So this rock fest dude, he can be killed with melee weapons, just pay attention to your health. But you know. We don't do it that way. But the one at the farm at the farm Keffer is actually telling you now. That you can no longer, you will not come to my farm unless you have guns. Because the boss at the farm is really difficult to kill without guns. Because he's as fast as a Frenchy Giant. He has more defense than a Frenchy Giant. And... Okay, so for some reason they're tag teaming. So, boop, boop. And this little mongrel heals. So you know what that means. Take out shotgun fun. Boom, there he goes. All right, so I don't like that boss. Because <laughs> that boss is a douche canoe. <laughs> but I got to figure out what loot to prioritize and see at the bunker so I can go kill the next boss. Now, for those who never saved up the bottles of gas, I'm going to show you why you wanted to save them all the way up to this event update. Gallons of gas give you 15 points, but bottles of gas are really easy to find. You can, like certain raids, you can get 40 bottles of gas, just like that. Bike events. The most I've got from a bike event is like 11 bottles. I can't get off in that area. I don't know why.
Jane the Mo Wait, so I, I grabbed that for no reason? Hmm. Where do you get this? I guess you get it from this. No notes yet. Learn the story of a crash ship by collecting and reading notes from dead zombies. <clears throat> hmm. Week one. Week two. Okay, so you can't even see them. But these rewards, though, are so worth it to get. This, a fully modded one, dude. All this stuff. So basically, you only have to worry about getting the wires and stuff like that. Because this thing... Oh, I want that so bad. Because this thing gives you the still. Some engine parts. So it may be possible to do within the time period. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's go to the boss battle. Okay, but I don't know if this is a bug, okay? But, you know, before the update came, if you pressed on the season pass, season one pass, it said a BSS, which you see up there at level 26, two tactical backpacks, there's two of them, AK-47 grenade launcher mod. I'm not seeing that for one. There's another thing, one more. I'm not seeing the mod anywhere. You can get the tactical upgrade for your VSS though, right here. But what I'm not seeing is the 100 steel plates. That, like I said before, I don't know if this is a bug, but I'm not seeing 100 steel plates. Because if you remember, if you pressed on it before the update came, you would see the VSS, two tactical backpads, several C4s, mill core. And you saw an AK-47 grenade launcher, and I'm really not seeing that right now. So, I don't know if it's a bug or what, but <laughs> they need to fix it, because I want my 100 steel plates. But today's bunker code will be 21433. If that's out of date by the time you watch this video, let me know in the comments below, and I will... Upload a pre um the actual bunker code if this one is out date. I just want to show: Am I the only one hallucinating, or does the gun shoot before it makes the sound? Cause I know I don't take any drugs, so I'm a little confused, and I don't know where this boss is gonna be. But I feel like it's gonna be by the best chest in the entire game. Yes, right there that I can't access. Do I get to the end? I have enough red tickets. Oh, oh, today is a good day. Besides the bosses I have to defeat, but it'll be all right. So I didn't find the boss, but let's open the two best chests. Well. I don't consider this the best. <laughs> Under no means possible. This! Bad boy. Give me three your names, please, please, please. Oh, two! I will take two! Look, that's two. That makes me happy. This one in the video, and I'm gonna find out how to bring the boss out. So I don't know how you bring him out. I know there's doors there, but I don't know where where those doors lead to, and you need a true friend straight dog. So I hope you enjoyed the video of the police department boss. Sadly, no floor four boss. I think you have to turn on hell mode. I'm gonna go check and start the next video for you guys. And peace out.